This is a Palestine. I'm going to call the, the Palestinians now. And it will mean nothing to me. So why you got this flag? Why you got Give this me flag? Answer us. If you are a man, you are not a coward. You are the coward. You are the coward. coward. Get you got me the a flag, flag of apartheid. Get you got a flag, flag that kills Christians. Get that kills kids. Why you got that flag? What are you going to do if you bring the flag? I'm going to carry it up here and preach Jesus. Yeah, but stop preaching no, Jesus with this. This does not represent you Jesus. Bring the flag. If I call this is against Jesus. This if I, is against Jesus. If I call the Palestinian flag, are you going to be offended? No, because uh, we support bias. Jesus. We support you are biased. Jesus. We Can love I Jesus more than you. I told you, my friend, you got to do something. Goyim, sweaty yes. Goyim. Sweaty Goyim. Hey, my friend, how much is it? These guys are asking to be represented by the and I will leave Have some out. water, have some water. You want some water? What? You are supporting <laughs> some water? Are you a supporter of Palestine? You want some water? And the flood? I'm a supporter of humanity. You the flood? I'm a supporter of life and peace Israel. and love. I support, I support you know, Israel. Israel. <laughs> huh? I, I yes. Support if you didn't know, I support Israel. Yeah. So you know why? Because Jesus was born in Israel. That's why we support Israel. Where was he born? There was no such thing like that. Philistine. Philistine. Palestine never existed. Philistine. He was Philistine. And Philistine. And Philistine. Philistine. That used to live long time ago. Yeah. They don't exist. Doesn't matter. It wasn't Canaanite. It wasn't called Israel. Then was it? Most yeah. of the Palestinians. Yeah. Okay, who killed Jesus? Yes, Arafat. Yes. Sorry. Do you know that Yasser Arafat doesn't know you? Who killed Jesus? Yes. Okay, you know. You know. You know who killed Jesus? Yes. Who killed Jesus? 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 Who killed to the top of my voice. What a foolish idea you got in your mind that I'm paid. My friend, Definitely I've been coming in Hyde Park from 1990 as a small young man up to now because I love to preach. I've gone to New York, I've gone to California, Sacramento, even Mexico, in Germany, in Lithuania, in Latvia, I'm preaching the gospel. Is that live recording? I take my holiday, no, no, no. I go, go preach. To Israel, preach. I love to preach. To I don't want nobody to pay me. To because Israel, I love preach. Jesus, that is why I preach. Jesus you don't know Jesus. Jesus you don't know. You got no idea. You haven't got a clue. I am preaching. I want to make you upset this afternoon. You are fooling my lady. God bless you. I tell you, sir, Jesus is the Son of God, is God in the flesh. The problem is, a lot of people don't read the Bible. When you read the Bible, then you can know who Jesus is. My friend, you are just there. from India. You don't know Jesus. And if you die today, hell will be your destination. Africa, no. Jesus said, I am could be yes. The light of the world. I'm not here. I'm not here, my friend, to debate with you. But I tell you, my friend, I challenge you. You have no power of God. I would make the assumption. You don't have the power of God. You got words. The Quran is just words. Has got no power to cast out devils. The Quran has no power to heal the sick. You don't. But Jesus and His name has got power. To raise the dead, cast out the devil, heal the sick. He's going in China, the Christian Chinese, in Africa, all over the world. The name of Jesus is powerful. But the Quran is a weak book, very weak. The Quran is weak. It's got no power, just words. 
Let us be preserved or not, your book is a weak book. But the Bible is a powerful book. It's a weapon that Satan is terrified. When you show the Quran to Satan, he says, Thank you very much for taking my book and confusing the mind of Arabs and Muslims all over the world. Satan confuse your mind by reading the Quran instead of the Bible. Instead of Jesus, you are taking a wrong book. A book that is propagated by Satan himself. You can love my son, the strongest voodoo will destroy you. A voodoo man will destroy you, even you, my brother. Are you can say, yap, 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 but I know what I'm talking about. When you are praying and fasting, you do the whole day. And then you eat food in the evening, you have broken the fast. That means you have done only that few hours. To go to the next day fasting, you eat in the evening, you have broken the fast. Fasting means abstaining from food. That is what the prophet did. That is what Moses did. Elijah did. Jeremiah did. Up to John the Baptist. Even today. Christian who knows a real fasting. Once you started, you don't eat food in the evening. I do my fasting, I don't have to tell you. I don't have to publicize for the whole world to know. That is what the Pharisees, the scribe, were telling, oh, we are fasting, oh, they got a long face, we are doing this. Your reward, you're very receiving by letting the world know. Jesus said, when you pray, go and close your door and pray to your heavenly Father. He will reward you because you are not making it known. Any prayer that you make it known to the public, it is meaningless. And when you are praying, you are repeating the same word every day that is in prayer. That is not prayer. When you are talking to your wife, do you tell your wife the same thing every day? No, my friend. Exactly. You are prayer. You are always saying the same word, repeating the same thing. That ain't prayer, my friend. I am telling you the way you pray. You are repeating things, repeating words every day, every month. Every year, repeating the same thing, my friend. That is the same kind of thing you are talking You would expect to him to say, oh, I like the debates. And but prayer is communicating with God. When you pray to God, God must speak to you. If God doesn't speak to you, there is a question mark. Then you are not following God in a right way. Why do you are not following the right God? When you pray, God has to speak to you. That's what Jesus said. When you want to pray, go and close your door. Don't tell people to know. It is a secret between you and God. Then you will be rewarded. Imagine I'm praying now. I want everybody to know that I'm praying. What you know is the phone. This is what the phone is for. I'm taking a break. Believe in Jesus and you shall have a better life.